Today, we're traveling to the Great Wall of China, one of the most recognizable and amazing buildings in the whole world. This historic masterpiece has withstood the test of time and is packed with incredible details that will wow you. The Great Wall of China is a tribute to human creativity and tenacity due to its vast length, inventive technical methods utilized to construct it, and the legends of the courageous warriors who guarded it. So let's get comfortable and discover the fascinating world of the Great Wall of China. Number 1. The longest structure ever constructed by mankind is the Great Wall of China. The Great Wall of China is undoubtedly one of the largest and most amazing monuments ever constructed by humanity. Over 13,000 miles long and weaving over plateaus, mountains, and deserts, it traverses China. Number 2. It was constructed to defend China from foreign invaders. The wall, one of the most formidable defenses in the world, was initially built to deter invaders from approaching China's northern boundaries. It was expanded and reconstructed throughout time. Instead of being in one continuous wall, the Great Wall of China is really a collection of walls, forts, and watchtowers that were built and renovated over a long period of time. Number 3. It is regarded as one of the world's new seven wonders. One of the most famous architectural and technical feats in history is the Great Wall of China. Some of its components date back more than 2,000 years, making it an amazing example of ancient engineering. Millions of visitors visit it every year as a representation of China's rich historical and cultural legacy. Its significance and international renown are significantly increased by the fact that it was named a UNESCO World Heritage Site in 1987. Number 4. To walk from one side to the other, it would take around 18 months. Indeed. It would take a long time to walk the full length of the Great Wall of China. It is estimated that it would take around 18 months to walk from one end to the other if you were to walk continually. The actual amount of time would depend on a number of variables, including the rate of walking and the precise route selected. However, keep in mind that not all of the Great Wall's parts are accessible or even in good condition so finishing such a trek would probably take a lot of planning and preparation. Number 5. Genghis Khan breached the wall. Early in the 13th century, Genghis Khan, the creator of the Mongol Empire, led his army in battle against the Chinese. The Great Wall was breached by the Mongols, who thereafter took control of large swaths of China. Despite not being able to stop the invasion, the wall did slow down the Mongol army and make it harder for them to advance farther into China. The wall was not always well maintained, and some portions were stronger and more easily defended than others. Number 6. One third of the walls are no longer there. The Great Wall has sustained tremendous damage throughout the years as a result of erosion, calamities, and human activity. The wall has suffered damage from the elements, including rain, wind, and earthquakes, which has led to certain sections of the wall crumbling and eroding. Additionally, several portions of the wall were damaged or destroyed during the Cultural Revolution in the middle of the 20th century when people stole building materials from it to use in their own construction projects. The Great Wall's structural integrity has suffered severe losses as a result, making it more challenging to preserve what is left. Despite these difficulties, the Great Wall has been restored and preserved in recent decades. Funds have been set aside by the Chinese government for repair initiatives. Number 7 
It contains buried human remains. Human remains can be found in several portions of the Great Wall of China. It took a lot of resources and labor to build the wall, which was a big endeavor. Conscripted laborers, convicts, and soldiers made up a large portion of the workforce that constructed the wall. Some of these employees are said to have been interred within the structure of the wall. There are rumors that the wall's defenses have been used to bury troops who perished while guarding it. Although the precise number of human remains found inside the wall is unknown, they represent an important chapter in its history and serve as a reminder of the costs associated with its construction and defense. There have been initiatives to find and preserve the human remains that are buried inside the Great Wall in recent years. A number of tombs and soldiers' graves have been found within the wall by archaeologists, and these finds have thrown new insight on the wall's past and how it was built. Thank you for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe for more videos.